What is good, y'all? You do what I'm saying? And welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger for y'all. As y'all can see, we are not in our normal setting. I am at work editing this video, getting it ready to get um, uploaded for y'all. I'm probably going to upload it at work. Um, and the reason why I have to do this intro now is because I shot two videos on Saturday, and the intro that I shot in the morning was for another video, not for this video. So gotta go ahead and open it up. So in today's video, you guys see the title, you see the thumbnail, let's go ahead and roll the intro and get straight into this banger. Let's get it. <laughs> Good job, you dig. Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy J.I. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Enjoy the video, you dig. Pulled up to the versatile crib. Getting Mamba put up on the ramps. Can't get Mamba up on the ramps, y'all. Hold on. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm fucking dead. I'm dead. All right, y'all. So, as you can see, this put up on my guy Versatile. You feel me? What's good, y'all? You know what I'm saying? Got the Versatile vet in the coop chilling. But, oh, damn, damn. today. We're gonna be knocking out the install on the RGB headlights, man. The Demon Eye, the extra Halo ring, all of the above. Because I'm tired of having the winky eye, the twinkle toes, on the goddamn, on the goddamn headlights. So let me show you guys what I'm talking about. I'm gonna go ahead and cut on the DRLs. Because, you know what? You gonna leave me alone. Alright, so. There you go. Just straight off the rip. You feel me? So we're going to be replacing that joint. Also replacing this joint. And installing the Demon Eye. All the day, man. Show them the magic trick, though, in you. <laughs> That's crazy. You shouldn't have to do that, man. <laughs> J.I. J.I. Insert clip of um that one that one meme they ask you if you find. And you someone that you know and they ask you how you are and you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine but you just can't get into it because they would never understand all right y'all quick little update you dig what i'm saying we got the headlights and the front bumper off took a little minute but we got it you dig what i'm saying big versatile this nigga out here went working out yesterday it's been like 13 years it's been been 13 years since this nigga picked up a weight goddamn so this nigga moving big uh slow goddamn you know what I mean, but we got the headlights out. Finna go ahead, throw them in the oven, get them open up, opened up, and then we'll go ahead and start inserting the new lights. But before we do that, I want to go ahead and connect everything and make sure everything turns on because I ain't got time for the BS if I install this shit and it don't fucking work. And lighting trends out here bullshitting. So, with this being said, bro, these suck. Customer service, I'm going to keep it a buck, bro. It's trash. It's so upsetting. So what I'm going to do is, if this doesn't work out, I'm going to go ahead and make the switch to Oracle because I'm tired of dealing with their BS, bro. They don't respond whenever you need them to. They don't ever want to call the kid. You know what I mean? They don't ever want to answer the phone. They don't ever send no damn instructions. It don't make no sense. So with that being said, bro, J.I. taking away the stamp of approval, big cap. They big cat. All right, y'all. So I just want to keep it a buck with y'all real quick and apologize for the lack of content and the lack of filming in this video. Doing the install was definitely, definitely difficult just because I had no idea what the hell I was doing as far as installing the Demon Eye, trying to get into the housing for the halogen bulb, um, I mean, the HID um, bulb where the Demon Eye would sit. 
was definitely a task. Um, the instructions that I got from lighting trends, I ended up calling them being on hold for like 40 minutes. The instructions I got from them were very vague, um, not specific to my car or anything like that. So I was literally just winging it. My guy, Lester, had to take a torch. We literally took a torch to the headlight itself to cut it open so that we'd be able to get the demon eye inside um, into the headlight. So it was definitely a whole ordeal. Um, but thankfully, after literally four or five hours, finally got them all taken care of. This is what we came out with. I'm not gonna lie, I'm still a little upset and I'm on the fence about staying with Lighting Trends. I might go ahead and make the switch to Oracle or go ahead and buy all new headlights. I'm not 100% sure. We're gonna run this setup for a little while. I'm gonna go ahead and do what I was thinking about doing um, as far as tinting the headlights and fog lights and see if that you know pleases me a little bit more. If not, then I might just go ahead and say F it and go with a whole different headlight setup. So you guys let me know what you guys think in the comments down below, but let's go ahead and roll that footage. First time speaking to me, y'all, we finally got the Demon Eye and Mamba with the red on the fog lights, y'all. How she looking, how she looking. Oh my God. still on. Oh, that that just shine straight through it. Yeah. God damn, dude. Damn, dude. Got the pulsing in there. Finally got all them functions in there working. on the white on the white and red y'all can't really see it too good on camera the white's so bright on the outside but he has a red on the demon eye in the middle there y'all go y'all can see it a little bit That's with the regular lights, y'all. Okay. So yeah, you can't even much tell the difference between the demon eye and the, the stock red, the regular, yeah. Okay, for sure that. Hey man, say man, you dig? I know I'm too dark for y'all to see, so I'm gonna close this video out when I get to the crib. Not lighting All right, y'all, so that's gonna be it for this video. Finally got the demon eyes and Mamba. Of course, lighting trends did not send me the module to control the low series halo ring inside of the headlight so we're waiting on them to send that out and then we'll go ahead and get those connected but we do got the drls and the demon eyes and the fog lights all connected and running smoothly um just have to ground a couple more boxes and then everything will be good to go i'm super stoked on the new look i love how it looks i really want to get the headlights tinted because i got some other stuff that i want to do to the car to go ahead and accent the white with the red Y'all make sure y'all do me a huge favor and go follow my boy, Tire Man. The Instagram is right here. He said at 500 followers, we get to do a fat-ass burnout in the parking lot.
And on top of that, we get to do it until the tires almost pop. And he's just going to replace them for your boy. I'm talking about a full set of tires for free for your boy. So y'all go follow him right now. Make sure y'all get him to 500 followers. If y'all trying to see Mamba, light the fucking tires up until them hoes pop. So without further ado, man, make sure you drop a comment in the comment section. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. Follow me on Instagram and add me on Twitter, man. I'm about to get back on my Twitter. I've barely been on it for the years that I've had it. So I'm starting to post on there more. So if you haven't already, make sure y'all go follow me on Twitter. It pops up right here. Follow me on Instagram. Add me on Snapchat. Give this video a big thumbs up. Drop your comments in the comment section. Make sure you tag your at so I can give you guys the JI Squad shout out. And stay tuned because I got merch coming. Whole bunch of stuff coming, man. Let's just continue to grow. With that being said, I'm going to see you guys in the next one. Peace.